Hello children, let us do an experiment today. This experiment is to demonstrate osmosis. Okay, to, to demonstrate how osmosis takes place. Now what you are taking over here is, this is a thistle funnel. Now this is a beaker. This is a retort stand. Now in the thistle funnel, the one end of the mouth of the thistle funnel, it is closed with cellophane paper. And inside the thistle funnel, sugar solution is taken. Sugar solution. Outside in the beaker, there is water, plain water. Now, initially what is done is, the thistle funnel is filled halfway with sugar solution, strong sugar solution and outside it, there is water. This thistle funnel it is inverted and put inside this beaker where there is water. Okay, first you can put the uh, thistle funnel down and then put the plain water from outside. Now Initially, what you're doing is, yes, it is fixed to the retort stand. Now, it is very important to mark the level of the sugar solution in the stem of the thistle funnel. Right on the stem, you can see the first arrow showing initial level. So, the level of the sugar solution is marked in the thistle funnel. Then, this experimental setup is kept for 2-3 hours. And then afterwards, when, we, when uh, the apparatus is checked, the experimental setup is checked, it will be seen that the sugar solution has ris risen from its initial level and it has gone to another level. The level of war, the sugar solution rises from the initial level, okay, it has risen to a another level. From here what we can conclude is water solution from outside water molecules have entered the thistle funnel and secondly the uh, water outside when it was tasted if it is tasted there is no sign of sweetness which means that Sugar molecules have not come out from the thistle funnel. And the third thing is that the, at the mouth of the thistle funnel, there was cellophane paper. So this cellophane paper has acted like a selectively permeable membrane or a semi-permeable membrane that has allowed water to get inside from outside but no sugar molecules have come out from the thistle funnel. So these are the three things that can be proved from the experiment. And we can say that yes, osmosis has taken place because water has moved from outside to inside. No, inside the thistle funnel. What is osmosis? It is the movement of water molecules from its region of higher concentration what does it mean its region don't forget the word its region from the region where water is in water molecules are more it'll move from there to a region where water molecules are less through a semi-permeable membrane so this is the definition osmosis is the movement of water molecules from its region of higher concentration to its region of lower concentration through a semi-permeable membrane. It just means that where water molecules are more, it will always move from there to where water molecules are less. Inside, water molecules will be less because this is a concentrated sugar solution. And the cellophane paper has acted like a uh, semi-permeable membrane. 
Now, what you can see is there are two regions of different concentrations, okay? Inside, the concentration is high because it has solute, sugar dissolved in it. And outside, the water, the concentration is low. With two regions with different concentrations, this is called the this is called tonicity, T-O-N-I-C-I-T-Y. Two regions with different concentrations. So thank you. I stop here today, but please go through the through your books also. Just read the lesson through your books also.